What is going on everybody? This is Michael M. Vassis from MichaelMVassis.com. I'm making this quick tutorial about a great app that I use to track my Instagram followers, likes, best posts that I've made, all that stuff. It's a great analytics tool. It's not Crowdfire. I know that's sort of the go-to app that everybody goes to, but I personally like InstaFollow. So I'm going to go into this just to give you a little bit of a rundown and refresh it here. InstaFollow is great because you can see all your blockers, the people that block you, and it does happen, your gained followers and your lost followers. To me, this is like probably one of the best, best things that you can track, and I check this probably three times a day. So if I go into my gained followers... You can see I got a couple and this just happened not that long ago. So I'm going to clear them out. Lost followers. I have no lost followers. But those are great to, to track your lost followers because there's a lot of people that, that get online. They'll follow you. They'll get you to follow them back because you reciprocate a follow and then they unfollow you. For me, I'm not, I'm not very into that kind of thing. I don't like that. So I will immediately unfollow anybody that does that. But another great feature about this, and these are paid features for this app, the, me the Media Insight. So I'm just going to update this. Now when I say paid, this app in total cost me less than $10. And I think that the, the value that it provides is just top notch. So uh, let's go into most popular media. As you, can, you can see, the, re the reason why this is so good is you can look at your most popular media. You can look at the hashtags you used what your message was, what the picture was, and, and try and replicate that once in a while. You know, change things up. Uh, people like to see about blogging, right? So, and this will go down. You can show more media. It'll go right down to basically nothing. Zero likes, zero hearts, and all that stuff. <clears throat> Most like media is pretty well the same. And then we have our least popular media. See, I got I get zeros. I get zeros. I got a few zeros there, and that's all good. Nobody liked this post. But it's good to track, right? Very good to track. It shows up here, you know, how many likes per post, comments per post. It's pretty cool. And then you have user engagement. <clears throat> I'll refresh this. This is really good because... And personally, I like to do, say, every second day or so or every third day, I like to show my my top likers and supporters. So I'll go into this, and it'll show you from the top down who your top likers are. Isn't that cool? I think that's pretty cool. Speechless likers. And... Let's see, secret admirers usually are people that don't follow you. Yeah, that's what, exactly what this is. So this gets, it, it shows you all that great, great information. User insight. Okay. So just an excellent app. Excellent app for keeping track of everything. I'm just going to refresh that one more time. Keeping track of your Instagram. I think this is much better than, than uh, Crowdfire. So... That's it. That's it for that tutorial on how to use the great app called InstaFollow. I'm Michael M. Vassis from MichaelMVassis.com, and you have yourselves a great day, and be great.